Hello everyone. Uh, in this video, we will we will try to know how to create our custom data set for training in a layout lmv 3 model. So what layout lmv 3 model does is like it will extract the exact text what we want to extract it from the whole scan document. So like uh, similarly, uh, it is a while receipt data set where we have the input image of a while receipt and we need to pass three different modalities to the model though one is the bounding boxes so if you compare the same image file has been given over here in the data set uh, the sample data set will be looking like this so we will be creating our data set uh, like this one which we have done using a uh, wild receipt data set and this receiver this data set consists of as uh, discussed three modalities one is the bounding box of the text and the other would be the text itself like the, the characters in the text itself and the other one is the label so these three things we, we need to extract it and create it in a data set or train or test format so that we can input that to a uh, layout lm family models so currently to create this type of data set we don't have any open source version to directly do it or we have one hack to do that so that is in label studio uh, there is a link that is provided by the label studio itself i will provide this in the description so the, here they have mentioned it as using tesseract we uh, tesseract uh, ocr of ocr can the ocr will extract all the text in the image what you were uploading and it will create those bounding boxes for you and in the label studio you can create a label for whatever the things you have made whatever things you want to extract it but the issue with the current method is uh, uh, tetherrack is unable to identify few of the text boxes like here if you see here it cannot able to identify the 1700 the other integer value and sometimes if you want to extract it whole of the items as a one single label and the one single level you want to describe all the items you want to like it's not customizable if you if you were using this so what we can do is uh, we can use the same template whatever the tetherrack is creating and uh, we can create our own custom data set and instead of tetherrack we can use our own paddle ocr or any other ocr models so we will uh, so we will try to do that now so first we will install uh, label studio itself to install label studio as i have created an virtual environment using ppnv uh, but you can create your uh, you can create using virtual env though, so though ppnv is a better option comparing to virtual env so to install label studio you just need to do pip install label hyphen studio so as i am running in pip env so i will be using pip env install studio so this will install label studio and in the meanwhile we will copy and paste the code which is provided by label studio itself so after go the whole code will be available in the end so you can directly copy and paste those code installing label studio we need to install five as like as well for this project just to extract text using this file tracer that goes here after you install the pytracer that goes here you need to download the pytracer that .exe file as well and you need to specify the path of the that I can label studio uh, you just need to run the command as label hyphen studio then it will launch the label studio If you are opening it for the first time it will ask for creating an account after creating an account you can see a page similar to like this uh, here you can create a project uh, you will name as you save it and here we will upload the json file which we have created using the python script Place on here, you need to do 
as an image but here we cannot load those so what we will do is we will go to settings label interface and in browse template we will select the OCR and here we will remove this we will remove it as we will write it as a level score 1 and we can label it as per our requirement but I have for the same thing I have given as 2 we can change the color as well over here so here what we will do is we will delete this one and we will import the image directly what we want to label it After importing here, uh, we can create the bonding box manually. First, we will select the label, and in the label too, we will we will write the layer text as whatever the text we have seen here. or it is up to you whatever the data type want you create if you are creating any like key value pair extraction it would be the label would be a key and the value would be the uh, key characters what you want to extract it and that will be the label and by clicking on submit it will save and if you again go to the project and you can export as for type format you want and we will get the similar data set what we what we are expecting for uh, to train it for the layout in Lamborghini model. Yep, thank you.